Now, your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you. Hi, I'm Alan Campbell and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. A man is dead after crashing on the freeway. It happened around 2 o'clock this morning on the westbound lanes of I-94 and Telegraph. Police say a 36 year old man lost control of his car and smashed into a guardrail. When he got out, several cars hit him, but only one of them stopped. Police believe marijuana may have been involved. A graffiti artist is fixing the mural he painted of the Queen of Soul after it was vandalized overnight. We're told it was discovered by a friend of the artist this afternoon. It's painted on the back of the old Busy Bee hardware at the Eastern Market. The artist says vandals grabbed paint sitting on a cherry picker to destroy the mural. Union nurses reached a tentative three year deal with the University of Michigan. Their previous contract expired June 30th and they've been working on negotiating a new one ever since. Just last week, the union voted to walk off the job for unfair labor practices, but didn't set a date. Nurses plan on ironing out the details of their new contract in a series of meetings. They'll vote to ratify a final contract in the coming weeks. Let's check in now with 7 First Alert meteorologist Hallie Vogel. Another cool night with a chance for a few showers as those clouds increase. Better chance for rain tomorrow as a warm front makes its way through. And we'll see waves of these showers coming and going during the day tomorrow. And it'll carry us into Monday, even Tuesday, that chance for rain. But you can see those temperatures going up into the low 70s on Tuesday, mid 70s on Wednesday. Wednesday looks to be about the only full dry day of the week. Temperatures stay in the 70s, though, even through the end of the week. All right, Hallie, sounds good. And folks, be sure to tune in next Saturday for our countdown to kickoff. The one hour pregame show starts at 11 a.m. and will lead up to the start of the Michigan Maryland game. We'll have live reports from both Brad Galley and Justin Rose. Those are your headlines from 7 Action News. Head to WXYZ.com and download our app for news anytime. Have a great night. These have been your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you.